once I made the transition from track to road that then I realized like, oh, all of a sudden clicked for me. I just learned how determined I had to be. I went and developed the personality that you need to have if you want to progress as an athlete. Having the racing and training every day, that gives me a sense of purpose for each day and then that in turn drives me. I don't think of like a huge long-term goal. I just try and think of the shorter term everyday goals that will eventually help me achieve my big long-term goal. It makes it easier to stay motivated like that as well. Win the day. That is something I read in a coaching um, philosophy book. As soon as I read it, it just became my mantra. Like it was on my screensaver on my phone. I would just write it down. It's so true, um, especially for athletes and elite athletes. They can get so caught up in a huge goal that is so far down the line that they forget about the small goal of today, Tuesday or Wednesday, whatever day, you know, that, that they have to treat every day like something they can win. You know, you have to get up and give your best for whatever training session you have. And you have to go to bed early because you've got a session the next day. And you might have to sacrifice a night out because you want to perform at your best. I think that quote really sums it up, win the day. I had to sacrifice a lot, you know, to get to where I am. I feel like in order to progress as an athlete at all, I've had to really put a lot into it. And you do miss out on a lot. The difficult thing isn't the sacrifices you make about nights out and things like that, the family things that you miss out on. And I think for me that that was probably the most difficult. Or when I look back on it, that's what I think, oh, that that's been the most difficult part of being an athlete. There has to be a sacrifice somewhere, you know, you're not able to do everything. I'm not able to, to race and do what I'm doing now if I don't sacrifice anything for it. I might have those long-term goals, I make them sound quite simple, but I also think that that kind of thing keeps me going on days where I'm really lacking motivation. I don't always think about it like one huge end goal. This week I'll have four small goals that I need to achieve that will eventually help me achieve my big end goal. That's what you need to break it down to. You just have to think, I have to get out on my bike today. I just love to wear the Irish kit on the road. Like that for me, that feeling would just, I wouldn't even be able to describe that. It would just be so amazing. I would love to think that people would look to me for inspiration. I, I find that amazing but I find it more encouraging. Like if I think that people are looking towards me for inspiration, that will encourage me even further to just keep pushing. I know I haven't left any stone unturned, so I can just, I can be happy that I gave everything. I won't look back and have a regret if I don't turn pro because I know that I've literally done everything I can. I won't have any regrets.